Okay, so I have mentioned once or twice or maybe ten times that I am obsessed with Jennifer Lawrence. And so I've been doing a Jennifer Lawrence movie marathon where I'm watching everything that she's in and trying to learn because I love her acting so much. So recently I watched The Poker House. Hey, don't play with my jewelry please, Abby. Thank you. Sorry, cats. Um, so I recently watched The Poker House, which was an indie film that she did, I think, before Winner's Bone. Uh, it was one of her first lead roles in a film. And it centers around this girl, who is very much like her character in Winner's Bone, where she sort of takes care of her siblings, assumes the mom role. Her mom is a coke addict and also a prostitute. Um, so it's kind of about her navigating through her life with this responsibility and also not having a maternal figure and trying to create something better for herself. I'd say there's a scene where uh, her character's raped and she goes to the bathtub to like wash his dirt off of her and her mom comes in and she's she doesn't tell her mom that she's been raped but she is crying and very clearly her mom is just like all coked out and out of it and it's like one of the most heartbreaking scenes I have ever witnessed. And if you're a fan of Jennifer Lawrence, if you're interested in acting, if you're interested in indie films, watch this movie. It, it's a little slow at parts, but overall it is, it is pretty deep and powerful and impactful. And Chloe Grace Moretz is in it and plays Jennifer Lawrence's younger sister, so that's always fun. And I think what I liked most about the movie was, was we felt like we knew Jennifer Lawrence's character right off the bat. We were constantly rooting for her. We were super pissed when shit went down. And it was also, it was a really easy watch, I'd say, for such, for having such, like, hard, heavy material. It was beautiful. And the director, apparently this is sort of autobiographical and based on her life. So knowing that, it was even more interesting watching being like, wow. That sucked. I'm so glad you are directing movies now and like have moved past that horrible fucking phase in your life. So give the Poker House a try if you want. I'll put a link down below where you can get it or just rent it, whatever. And definitely, definitely have sex with this film because Jennifer Lawrence is in it. But be good to her. Don't, don't come on too fast. Don't, don't do the rapey thing. No one, no rape. No. No.